take into account of all the things we have discussed, what are your recommendations for investors in terms of asset allocation? We have a preference for equity risk. We, we think that you're still being rewarded and you're not going to get a big rise in US interest rates. So we, we quite like the developed markets at the moment, um, Europe uh, and Japan particularly, and also the United Kingdom. But we also like Asia Pacific markets on the equity side. So we like China's eight shares listed in Hong Kong. We like India, Singapore, and, and uh, Japanese property. Uh, you said you prefer eight shares, obviously. Well, we do, yes. Well, we like eight shares in general. Okay. So we like, we like that market. So if you had to choose between A and H, the valuation on eight shares at, what is it, six, six and a half times 2015 earnings is a really good value. There's only two markets in emerging markets that are cheaper. It's Nigeria and Russia. Both of those are commodity uh, countries, so you would want to hold the Chinese. Uh, any particular sectors? We like the banks. We think um, a number of the banking institutions are, are offering quite good what we call deep value, very low price-to-earnings ratios and price-to-book ratios relative to where they should be. And we like some of the new economy stocks as well, so the, 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 the anti-pollution measures, the, the telcos, the, the, the tech companies of China are, are offering quite, uh, quite good long-term uh, investment returns.